beauty of science is everywhere around us. One of the things that really grabbed our attention in this work was the organic notion of what was happening. It's literally as if these droplets are dancing. I was studying something entirely different back when I was an undergraduate several years ago and stumbled on this phenomena quite by accident. Even to my naked eye, the droplets were moving around on the glass slide. I was really surprised. I'd never seen that, and that seemed really, really strange and really new, and also really beautiful. And the physical properties of these fluids give rise to this immense complexity of behavior. For example, chasing and sensing each other, and very much what we call artificial chemotaxis. Chemotaxis is the idea in biology that one single cell can sense where its enemy is. And it rings up all its machinery and it chases that enemy to try to eat it. In food coloring uh, is a small molecule called propylene glycol. The droplets consist of this molecule mixed with water. It turns out that the binary nature uh, of the system, the fact that there are two fluids, and furthermore, the fact that they evaporate at different rates, and they have different surface tensions is critical for observing this phenomena. Many classes of two liquids mixed together will exhibit this phenomena. There is this juxtaposition of what is simple and what is complex. Uh, everyday phenomena are very, very simple when you look and observe them, but if you don't understand them, it ends up many, many layers of complexity. And that why, to me, is personally very exciting.